calculate the effective resistance of this resistor network. Well, we've got two resistors that are in parallel connected to a third resistor in series. These can all be replaced by a single resistance. So how do we do this? First of all, we need to combine the two resistors that are in parallel. And the formula for doing that is that one upon the combined resistance of the two in parallel, or the total resistance, RT, is equal to one upon R1 plus one upon R2. So this could be R1 and this could be R2. And this formula works for as many resistors in parallel as you like. You just keep adding on resistors like that, etc. But we've only got two today, so we'll only use the version with R1 and R2. OK, so let's deal with that first and let's put some numbers into that. So 1 upon R total is equal to 1 upon 15 plus 1 upon 10. Now, we will expect the combined resistance of these two parallel resistors to be less than the smallest resistor because electrons find it easier to flow. Let's say that they're flowing through the 10 ohm resistor and you add in the 15 ohm path. So it makes it easier for them to flow because they've got an extra path then to flow. So the resistance will be less than 10 ohms. So that's what we should find here. So let's combine these together. 1 upon RT is equal to 5 over 30, adding those fractions together. And now you can do a little uh, flip and literally flip both sides of the equation. They're both fractions. So RT is equal to 30 over 5. It would be RT upon 1, but that's the same thing as RT. And 30 divided by 5 is 6 ohms. And that makes sense. 6 ohms is less than the smallest resistor in the parallel combination. OK, so these guys now can be replaced with a single resistor of 6 ohms. So we'd have something like this. There's our 6 ohms and now there's our 10 ohms. Now, when you're adding resistors in series like this, it's really easy because you just add them normally. So we get a resistor of 16 ohms. That's the equivalent resistance to this network. Hope that makes sense. I'll see you in the next flashcard.